what love means This is insane You're saying things I can't explain I know where your heart is Where you wanna be So why do you keep testing me? It just isn't worth my time To try to make you believe me When you don't believe me This is where I draw the line And pretend that I'm leaving This is me leaving I'll let you win What's up mga kagulay? It's another fun learning ideas in hydroponics and welcome back to my channel. Today's episode is about the post-harvest activity. On our previous video, we are happy to share with you about our first harvest here in our farm expansion. Well, despite all the challenges from quality of the water down to how we will able to transfer all the crops from here up to our home city which is Antipolo. I hope I encourage you guys that despite all the small problems in your farm, you will be able to continue doing great ideas inside your farm. I am very happy to share with you again that we sold all the crops that we bought in to the Antipolo, which is our home city. The income is very positive. I give all the salaries first to our farmers and, and then the rest, that would be my share. And yesterday, I bought another trike bike for us to reach other place in our city. That would be coming from our income last week. And maybe next time, I will buy again another track bike for us to reach to other city near in our place maybe you ask me Julius why are you able to sell on the street not inside the supermarket that is very nice idea on selling on supermarkets but we cannot afford the rentals yet we cannot pay the management of the supermarket that's why little by little maybe two to five years from now you will be seeing us selling or you will be seeing our products inside the supermarket other than that we will be selling again in our city streets so that we will be able to right away have an income now we will be unloading the styro cups from the L300 which is the main vehicle and we will be sharing to you what is our post harvest activity okay guys we will be unloading the styro boxes got a dopamine rush got a major league crush when you're next to me got my heart upon my sleeve can i hide the way i feel when you're next to me girl
these are the cups that we use in our lettuce. We will remove today all the cocoa choir inside the cups so that we will be able to load again the fresh lettuce inside the greenhouse later after doing such preparation like this. So I will demonstrate to them how to remove properly the cocoa pit in order for us to minimize the damage of the styro cups. So guys, this is how you do it properly. removing all the cocoa pit or cocoa choir inside the cups we are now going to load in those cocoa choir inside the steam cans so that we will boil it in the water for sterilization this steam can is the container of soya bar which i bought it yesterday in the sweat market near us so you just asked me if sir why would you rather choose this tin can over the traditional pots, the metal pots? Of course, this tin can is very, very uh, thin and you can easily boil in just a few minutes while the traditional metal pot, you end up probably 30 minutes to achieve the boiling point. So wisely, it's just uh, very, very cheaper rather than the metal pots. Now for those of you who are using rock wool, you will not be able to do this activity, the post harvest activity because you will sold all the rock wool together with the fresh lettuce. This is the most and very practical way on how we do it because we will have to recycle all the cocoa choir and we will have to sterilize it for a while and re reuse again. So that would be the sharing I will have to impart to you today in this episode. Now guys, we will go to boil the cocoa pit. Don't you wanna be free when you stay?
Sad now the spirit, amen. Bless us, O Lord, in this day gives which we are about to receive. And we are bound with the price, O Lord, in this day. Amen. Ayan na po, okay. Kap na lang, kap mga inuman. Ayan lang ginain niyo kanina. Okay guys, after removing all the cocoa pit inside the styro box, we will now going to place all of those in these tin cans. And then later, we will wait for the somewhat the water to be boiled and after that, we will let them dry and reuse it again. So that's the episode is all about today. I hope you learned from this episode again. Thanks for watching guys. See you next week. Bye.